Hello, today I'll show you how to make a farming game in Scratch. As you can see, this is a farming game, and if I buy a plot, it will do a nice effect. So let's get started. First, delete the cat and paint a sprite. Name it Farm. Farming. Use the box tool. Make the make sure there is no outline and make the fill a nice brownish color something like this now press shift and create a box and make it 100 by 100 something like this and name it zero. Now, when green flag is clicked, create a new variable named grid for all sprites. Set grid grid to z to one hundred. Then, another new variable named money for all sprites and display money. display now set money to a hundred set display money to money then create a new list called text info then add X add Y Add text, add visible, and then add color to text info. You don't have to have these. These are just to make it more organized. Now, after this, oh yeah, and also delete all of text info and then add now set size to grid and then create a create a new block named create plots run without screen refresh and then lastly hide now in here we do go to negative 180 to 120 then point in direction 90 and then create two new variables named plot cost for the sprite only and brought bot plot bot plot for this sprite only set plot cost to zero and block bot pop, bot pop plot to y which is yes then repeat four times then repeat three times Create a clone of myself. Change Y by size times actually grid times grid times negative one and then set bot plot to no or in and then change plot cost to 50 then at the bottom of repeat three times set y to 20 actually 120 and then change then change y change I mean change x by 
grid times 1.2 now if you test it as you can see it will create this nice row now go to backdrops then use the box tool make the fill a nice greenish color something like something like something like this Now, in in the backdrops, when green flag is clicked forever, change display money by divide, subtract money, subtract by display money, divided by three. This will create a nice move effect. Now, when 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 I start as a clone in farming we will do a show and then switch costume to zero then forever if else and then equals bot plot equals in then set ghost to 45 else sets ghost to 0 now another if else touching mouse pointer then we will do replace item 1 of text info with x position then duplicate this Replace item 2 with Y position. Replace item 3 with a join. And then join the money symbol with money. Actually with plot cost. And then uh, another if else money is greater than money is greater than plot cost subtracted by one then we will replace item five with seventy which is color and re else replace item five with zero then set brightness to 25 and and in the else of this one set brightness to 0 now if you test it as you can see it will have this nice selection system now go into the link of the description which will lead you to this and then go to see inside then click backpack drag the text into backpack then then go back to your game select your backpack drag it in and now you have text from 1 to z 0 to 9 and from A B C all the way to Z and the space bar there's the money symbol plus subtract underscore and dot and the lower and uppercase now after this we will do another if else after the set brightness effect to 25 then if else bot bot plot equals in then uh, if mouse down and then another if if duplicate the money greater than plot cost subtracted by one 
and if so change change money by plot cost times zero point I mean times negative one and set bot plot to y which is yes and at inside the if mouse down at the bottom of this if money greater than plot cost subtracted by one n wait until not mouse down and then in this else replace item four with replace item four with in and same with down here but on but with a but with a if plot cost equals zero which would be this one because we only need one of them to do this now after that and also make sure to du duplicate this and make sure to also if bot plot equals in then replace item 4 to with y here now in the text we will do when green flag is clicked hide then forever create a new block named create text pause x add an input name pause x add a label called pause y add an input called pause y then add another label called text add an input called text then add an input called size I mean a label called size and then an input called size then add a label called bright or brightness and then add an input called br bright then add a label called color and then add an input called color and finally run without screen refresh now we also have the variable digit from the text so now we will add in a block here and then we will add a if equal and then item for of text info equals y now x would be item 1 pause y would be item 2 text will be item 3 size will be 100 actually it will be grid and then bright would be bright would be 0 and then the color would be 5 of text info now set size to size set brightness to bright set color to color go to x pause y pause then set digit to zero and then repeat length of text then change digit by one switch costume to and then letter digit 
ledger letter digit of text create a clone of myself and then change 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 x by size size times 0 0.14 which if the size was 100 it would be 14 now if you test it and hover wait oh yeah and also make sure that when when I start as a clone make sure to show and then wait zero seconds for it to show for at least a split second now as you can see it will do this but also to fix to make it make it more centered we will do at create text pause x we will do a subtract and then grid times grid times 0 0.25 so item 1 of text info subtracted by a grid times 0 0.25 now if you test it as you can see it's a lot more centered now let's add the the money display get another block this time on top now x would be negative 220 y would be negative 160 the text would be join money money symbol rounded digit wait no rounded display money so something like this set size to 125 brightness to 100 and color to 0 now as you can see it will have a nice nice money display and it will also display how much the plot costs now you have part one of farming game in scratch thank you for watching and have a fantastic day